All right, guys, Mikey here from Mikey's Iron Rage. And guys, I got another hell of a Mr. Olympia comparison video again for use today. And before we get into that, I really hope everyone is staying safe out there because it's still so fucking bad here in New York City with this whole coronavirus shit. I mean, besides taking a walk around the block with my dog, I haven't left my condo in over a month. But I digress because I don't see this shit ending anytime soon. So guys, stay safe out there and remember to wash your fucking hands, huh? <laughs> but guys, anyways, on a lighter note, I got a good one for use today. Between 1999 Mr. Olympia 5th place finisher, Sean Ray. Versus 2009 third place Mr. Olympia finisher, Dexter the Blade Jackson. And I thought this would make for a very interesting comparison video. So guys, with that being said, enough with the chit chat. And let's just jump right into this one. Because I'm super pumped to see who wins this comparison between two of the best bodybuilders under 5'7 and under 225 pounds. So guys... With that being said, let's just jump right into it. So without any further ado, let's get it on. And we got the first pose of the night, guys. The front double bicep. And I could not get a front relaxed for 1999 Sean Ray if my life depended on it. I don't know what it was. If he didn't hit the pose at the uh, 99 Olympia. Or if there's just no pictures of him hitting the pose at the 99 Olympia. But all in all, I'm going to go with Dexter the Blade Jackson. Because first of all, I think Dexter's arms were the biggest in uh, 2009. His midsection's super tight. And then look at his quads. He's got big ass quads. In 2009, his quads were the biggest. Because if you think back to the 2008 Mr. Olympia, his quads were nowhere near as big. So Dexter Jackson's going to get the first point for the front double bicep. All right, guys, off to the next pose. And we got the hands class most muscular. And look at how good Sean Ray looks in this pose. Sean Ray always looked like he was 15, 20 pounds heavier. Every time he hits a most muscular pose, no matter if it's a hands class most muscular, a crab most muscular, he always looks like he's like 15, 20 pounds heavier than what he usually is. I really want to go with Dexter Jackson in this pose because I think Dexter displays an amazing hands class most muscular and he looks better than he did in 2008 in this pose. But I'm going to go with Sean Ray because Sean Ray looks a little drier, wider and bigger in that pose. All right, guys, now we get the front lat spread, and Dexter's silhouette looks unbelievable. I really want to go with Dexter in this pose, but I'm going to go with Sean. Sean's wider. He might have a wider midsection than uh, Dexter, but he is wider. His chest looks just as big. His arms and shoulders look just as big. Uh, the midsections, you could see the abs a little bit more on Dexter. And Dexter's quads are a little bit smaller than Sean. Sean really had a big set of quads. For a little guy that was only 212 pounds, he always had a big ass set of quads. So all in all, Sean Ray is going to get the point. All right, guys, now we got his side chest pose, and I'm going to give this to Dexter the Blade Jackson. I never really liked Sean Ray in the side chest shot, but from 1998 on, it was a lot better than it was from 1997 down. So I'm going to go with Dexter. Dexter's arms look big. He's got more striations. The side sweep to the quads look unbelievable. So I'm going to go with Dexter, but let me know what you guys think in the comment section below, because that one really could go either way. All right, guys, off to the next pose, and we got the side tricep, and there it is, that flat fucking pancake of a tricep that Dexter displays when he hits the side tricep pose. Maybe if he held it more like Sean Ray, it would look more deeply cut, and it would look maybe a little bit bigger, but then when, Sean, uh, when Dexter throws up a front double bicep or a rear double bicep, his fucking triceps look huge, and that's the illusion of bodybuilding, guys, but I digress. So, uh... My man Sean Ray is going to get the point. All right, guys, now we got the admin thigh. And this is probably the hardest pose for me to judge out of this whole fucking comparison video. Dexter Jackson's abs are unbelievable. And you guys know the way I feel about Dexter Jackson in the admin thigh pose. It's just absolute perfection. Okay? Yes, Sean Ray looks good, but his abs aren't as deeply cut. His quads look really good. So does Dexter's, but... I'm going to go with Dexter Jackson. I just think he looks a little bit better, in my opinion, in that pose. But let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. And like I keep saying, this is one close-ass comparison video. Let's see who's going to take it at the end of this. All right, guys, now we get the rear lat spread. And this one's definitely going to go to Dexter. Never liked Sean Ray in the rear lat spread. His traps are weak. His lower back is weak. He doesn't have much detail. 
Dexter Jackson, on the other hand, has crazy hams and glutes, a way better lower back, way better traps, and the silhouette is just way better. So Dexter Jackson is definitely going to get the point. All right, guys, off to the next pose, and we got the Christmas tree. And this was another tough one, but I'm going to go with Sean Ray because in 1999... I don't know, I think Sean Ray might have had the best Christmas tree I've ever seen. Now, they're holding it differently. Sean Ray's holding it down, like he's tilting his body down a little bit. And Dexter's, you know, faced up more. And that's why Dexter's upper back looks so good. Because Sean Ray's tilted forward. And Dexter's tilted back more. But I'm going to go with Sean Ray for the Christmas tree pose, guys. But that was another close one. All right, now we got the rear double bicep in the last pose of the night, guys, and it's all tied up four to four, four to four. And I tell you, Dexter Jackson's going to grab the last point. Dexter Jackson's just a lot wider. Sean Ray was never wide in the rear double bicep. I never really liked Sean Ray in the rear double bicep. And a lot of you guys say he had one of the best rear double bicep poses. I mean, yeah, it was good, but it's not better than Dexter Jackson's rear double bicep. So all in all, the blade Dexter Jackson's going to get the last point for the rear double bicep. Making Dexter Jackson break the tie, 5-4, to four, the blade Dexter Jackson over Sean Ray. Wow. But I did do a video on 08 Dexter versus what? 1997 Sean Ray? And I think 1997 Sean Ray came out by a point. I'm not sure though, guys. But I think it was on my old channel. But anyways, let me know what you think about this unbelievable comparison video. And if you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. Mikey's Iron Rage. Peace out, guys.